So there's a new AI coding tool that just dropped and this one is absolutely insane. It's called Android CLI and it just became the number one software development agent on a terminal bench with a score of 58.75%. That's higher than Claude Court, higher than every other AI coding assistant out there. And here's the best part. It's free to try. Let me tell you why this matters, especially if you're a developer or someone trying to learn how to code with AI. There are two types of people right now. Those who are learning these AI coding tools and shipping products faster. And also those who are still paying hundreds of dollars a month for closed models, wondering why their budget keeps shrinking. We're choosing to be in the first group. Droid is built by factory AI. And it's not just another coding assistant. This is a full agentic system that works directly in your terminal. It can plan tasks, execute code, debug, handle Git workflows, and even run complex multi-step operations all on its own. Think of it like having a senior developer sitting next to you, except it works 24-7, never gets tired, and can switch between multiple programming languages without breaking a sweat. It's model agonistic. That means you can use Claude Opus, GPT-5, Germany, or any other model you want, and it will still perform better than the other tools. In fact, the benchmarks show that Android with Claude Sonnet outperforms other agents using Claude Opus. That's how good the agent design is. Now, it's not just about the model. It's about how the tool uses the model. First, Droid understands your entire code base. When you start a session, it automatically pulls system information, environment variables, running processes, and repo contents. That means it doesn't waste time asking you for context. It already knows what you are working on. Second, it's fast, like really fast. Droid has been optimized for speed, which is critical when you are working on the real world tasks that have time limits. It uses tools like RipGrip for faster file searches, sets intelligent timeouts, and also avoids repeating slow operations. This is the kind of stuff that saves you hours. Third, it has a minimalistic tool design. A lot of AI agents fail because they try to do too much at once. Droid focuses on essential operations with the simple input schemas. That means fewer errors, better reliability, and also higher success rates on complex tasks. And fourth, and this is huge, Droid can learn wrong processes in the background. If you need to start a server, train a machine learning model, or run tests, Droid can kick it off and keep working on other tasks while that runs. That's something most AI coding tools can't do. Getting started with Android is simple. Head over to factory.ai, sign up for a free month account. Once you are in, you can install the Android CLI and start using it right from your terminal. When you log in with your account, here it's going to show. You can even log out if you want. But right, you're going to see, you can just copy this command here and paste it in your terminal and just press enter to start installing. All right, as you can see here, it's done installing. So right now, all we have to do is just run Android. This is also the same thing that we have on their uh, page here. You can run it in VS Code and also any other uh, VS Code like Fox, right? You can just run Android. This is the same also here. Just run that. Let's test it and see how it looks like. Just paste this here. Run it in Android. Just like that, this is what you're going to see, and this is how it looks like. So, when you run Android, this is how it looks like you are standing in an open terminal, and AI awaits your you know, you have all these here. So, this is how it looks like, and this is what you're going to see when you run Android. Here, you can uh, choose to log in or to create a factory account. This is what we want to we'll just place on the first option here, and it is going to uh, authenticate or take us to the page where we're going to have to create an account with the and then I'll just confirm you are all set and just like that here as you can see now we are in this is what you're going to see when you log in and when you run it for the first time this is Android and this is how it looks like we can uh, see how clean it looks now, for the sake of testing and seeing how good it is, we're going to have to build something like it, right? I'll just give it this prompt here and I'll wait for it to do its thing. Build a portfolio website with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript that includes interactive 3D card animation. Yeah, this is it. Uh, so here it plans, as you can see, it's making a plan and it's thinking. And also, I think it's fast. And here it is asking me to allow, to just select always. This is just the same as the these other AI terminals, right? I'll just uh, 
allow it let me zoom out a little bit here so we can see what it has done according to the plan the review current workspace structure create html css javascript and transition. just a quick note i'm upgrading my recording setup so you can see these coding demos even more clearly if you want to support creative ink academy there's a link in the description every bit helps in bringing you sharper and clear tutorials this is a web app that it managed to build we have the menus here all the menus are working and when we come on the project we can see different tabs here and all the 3d effect is working the web app is working all the apps and the everything here looks good we have uh, the grid here it looks clean and i click on view projects it takes me to the project section the contact down here we have a minimalistic looking contact section and the minimalistic looking footer the dark and light theme also works just fine without any problem i think this is pretty good i think it's powerful so yeah test it and see what you can build with it otherwise this is what the uh the android cli is capable of doing the fact that it is able to make a plan and follow through and make and create everything that it planned to do is pretty powerful it's pretty good so yeah, you can use it to build web apps or websites or games or whatever you are into. You can use it also to start your online business by building apps and softwares because it's powerful. You can also change to use different models depending on what you want. You can also use it in an NAR IDA, not just in the CLI, like not just in the command line, like the way we are using it. You can use it in, 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 you can use it in VS Code or Kiro. When you launch Android, you will see a full screen terminal interface. You can give it tasks in natural language, like add user authentication to this app, or fix the bug in the payment model, or refactor this code to use TypeScript. And here's what's different. Android doesn't just make suggestions. It actually does the work. It reads your files, writes code, tests it, and also debugs it. And even commits the changes to Git if you want. It's a full development agent, not just a code completion tool. Now, here's the reality. The world of software development is changing fast. The developers who are winning right now, they are not the ones writing every line of code by hand. They're the ones who know how to use AI to 10 times their output. If you're still coding the old way, you are going to get left behind by people who are using tools like Android to ship faster and build better and also get ahead. And look, I get it. Some people are scared of AI taking over coding, but that's not what's happening. AI is a tool and the people who learn to use it, they become unstoppable. So here is what you need to do. Go to factory.ai, sign up for a free month account, install Android and also start using it on your projects. Even if you are a beginner, you can use this to learn faster and also build real things. Try it out, test it on a small project, see how it handles debugging, refactoring and also adding new features. And then come back here and tell me what you think. This is, this is, this is one of the best AI coding tools I've seen. And if you're serious about staying competitive as a developer, you need to check it out. Now, if this helped you discover a tool that will save you hundreds of dollars while making your code faster, hit that subscribe button. We are building a community of developers who stay ahead of the curve with AI tools that actually deliver results without breaking the bank. Thank you for watching Creative Ink Academy and I'll see you in the next video.